our trip starts now. Okay, I guess we're boarding already. It looks so rough today, beautiful sunny day, which means you can lay out and get a tan. Kiteboarding starts tomorrow. How are you feeling? Good, sweetheart. How was the plane ride? I'm very proud of myself, that's all I can say. I'm very proud of you too. <laughs> funny. You did really well. Thank you. Last time we took a boat, we were like... It doesn't oh, look so like rough. <laughs> it doesn't look so rough today. Looks like we're good. Uh oh, it's windy. Look at it. That's a beautiful day today. And we have arrived. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Shangri-La for Raka. It's not as wavy as last time when we were here. Look how beautiful the water is. I always remember that spot. Oh, you, you did that photo shoot right there. Yeah. Hello. I love Shangri-La service. So awesome. Oh, I miss this resort so much. Yeah. So beautiful. Here. You know, Mike, before, I was one of the models for Sea Air. And then we shot here in Shangri-La, but Shangri-La wasn't complete yet back. This is where I had my amazing birthday party. We have arrived. Thank you. Our temporary home. Welcome to the room for the next nine days. The beautiful view. Oh my god, it's so beautiful. Oh, hey! I love our photos! <laughs> so cute! And when we were here and also when we were here in Shanghai. Yes. <laughs> like so recent, I did that like three days ago. Wow, they scoped out your IG. And yours. Cool. This place is so beautiful. Yeah. 
<laughs> and we've packed everything up and we're gonna head to Bulabog to go kiteboarding. Holding. Holding. So if you guys are ever interested to go kiteboarding, you can go check out my friend's resort, Banana Bay, and they're in the Bulabog side. Check out this place. Come on, come on. Gonna put the camera down, say hi. Our top house. Where's Sasan? Is that Sasan? Out there. I did no gas gas come on. Yeah, because I can see yeah, it's no. standing. Oh. <laughs> that spot over there. Don't stay within. Stay outside. If I'm gonna go yeah, there. If you go inside there, there's a dead spot there. Their kite will fall. This is Ming. <laughs> Ming in his private resort. Oh, nice. Uh, <laughs> closed down banana bed. <laughs> so apparently this resort is closed. Keith, why haven't you opened your resort? Oh, we just rebuilt it. Oh. Yeah, so when this is you, the new look. When are you planning to open? Um, a couple months, I don't know. Awesome. Looks good. Lynn was nice enough to give us a room somewhere downstairs so we can hang out and change after we kite. But for now, I'm gonna put the camera down and enjoy the view. So I can't film at the moment because apparently I have lessons now. I'm gonna get coached to go kiteboarding and fix my technique for jumping. I just met Ken who's gonna be my coach and we're gonna do some coaching session first and hopefully later or tomorrow I can film the kiteboarding because also the sun's not out and it looks a little gray. So it's day three of testing the DJI mic and there's nothing bad that I can say about this mic. I really absolutely love it and I think it's gonna be replacing all my other mics moving forward. It's such an easy system to use. The backup safety system with the internal recorder makes so much sense. Hi, hello, Kirby. hello, yeah. Yes. Yes. That's Ken. Ken's an awesome coach and he was fixing my off hook tricks yesterday. And it's super hard. I kept crashing. Not something I normally train for, but because it was weak wind yesterday, that was the training. Hi, Sam. Hold it! Hold it! Sad ending to the day. I had to stop because I injured my shin and I cut it up pretty bad. So I hit the board from one of the jumps. I don't know if you can hear this because it's windy, but I'll show you guys a snippet of it when we get down. I can still walk, but I feel it throbbing already. So I think tomorrow, no kite recording because even the shin bone is painful. Not cool, but part of pushing progression and trying to go bigger. Hello. 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 Hello.
Hola. How's your day? This is yours? Oh, there. Who's this? Cheers. Where's your day? None? Lapa. Lapa. Okay, I'll wait. I'll wait. Moving location because it's about to rain. Here's the birthday venue that Chang has given me. Nice secluded area. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, happy birthday, happy birthday to you. One more time. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, happy birthday, happy birthday. Sun's out. Get a little tan. session that was interesting. I was taking it easy because my cut on my shit is still uh, still moving and healing so but even though I took it easy I did a 9.2 meter jump which was awesome. I'm going to the room now to change and then chill out for a bit. If you guys are interested to kiteboard you can rent this place. There's individual rooms but you can do a corporate package and uh, We'll do a group booking and then get your lessons done. Whew. I'll show you my room. This is one of the corner suites. This is the suite room. There's the bed. Get out of my wet clothes because I'm dripping everywhere. This is the bathroom. There's a bathtub, little makeup table. Right. Water shower, two twin sinks. Get the safe here. And then living area, small. I won't say it's a kitchenette. There's no stove. And then you have the view, the little balcony here. Today in uh, our day, we're going to go to Balabog again because it's the birthday of my friend Ming. And then we're gonna go kiteboard and then just chill out there till the afternoon. Hopefully, maybe we have a chance to just walk around and get some more snippets. But yesterday I had so much fun riding and I really appreciated the beauty of Bora because it was nice and sunny, the water was nice, the wind was super strong. And yeah, just watching all the kiters jump, especially Warner and Sasan, and they're all getting higher. And I just need to catch up and jump even higher. So. That's my update for today. Um, I'm gonna charge up everything and hopefully get some last good footages before the weather turns bad. So we've been stuck here in the island for an extra two days because of the typhoon that has ravaged the middle of the Philippines but today is a sunny day and we decided to add another day so that we can enjoy the beautiful weather again Tonight 
nice bikini you have there. Oh wow, funny because you have kind of like the same one. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. It's the last day here in Shang, and I guess I'm going to just end the vlog here already. I actually don't know what storyline I'm going to do with the content that we've shot this week. But then again, if you guys are still watching, thank you so much. Hope you guys are having a great December, and I will see you guys again soon in the next video. Peace out. It's always the sad part, leaving. Even if we've stayed 12 days already. Thank you. Thank you so much. <laughs> that was a fun and quick boat ride. The driver was really enjoying himself, going around the waves. There's so much debris in the water from the typhoon that just happened. But yeah, I think now we're going to really end the vlog here. I'll see you guys again in the next video.